Hi guys, welcome to Geek New Zealand. We back with another review of a gadget. This is a Nomad's leather wallet. It's a, it's a leather wallet with integrated battery for your iPhone. Uh, it also has some other neat features like um, it has a RFID blocker, so it stops uh, anyone trying to steal your card data from electronically. It uh, can fit in up to six credit cards and it has storage for cash as well so it's a normal leather wallet but with an extra tick it gives you a power bank inbuilt and a charger cable to charge your iphone in case you are out and about and you lose your battery power uh, with my iphone i normally run out of power within like a couple of hours because i use so much um, apps and you know Bluetooth and everything going on I do have a um, external battery which is the Mophie battery which gives me a full charge but it makes my phone a bit bulky so I was looking for something which you know I don't have to carry the extra battery and I always carry the wallet I always have the credit cards so I always need the leather wallet with me so I thought this is a really nice thing to have especially for an iPhone user Let's unbox it and have a look of how so the wallet unbox is. the wallet. Now, the wallet, that's the battery pack here, and that's the cable, lightning cable for you to charge your iPhone. So, it feels a little heavy, and it's obvious because of the pack, but otherwise it's a good solid. Leather wallet. It comes with a um, cable to charge your battery pack and I don't know whether out of the box it has any juice on it so I'm just gonna plug my iPhone and have a play around. I'm also gonna show you my current bulky iPhone because I use this external battery pack which I want to get rid of. Um, this is the Morphe batteries. And this is my existing wallet, which is also very bulky. So I'm gonna transfer some of my credit cards into this one and connect the iPhone out of the box and see if it has any juice or do I need to charge. So I emptied my existing wallet, which actually had 10 cards in it. So I could put only six of them here. But since I don't use much cash, I put all my other cards at the back. It still feels okay little bigger than my existing one and still a little bigger but uh, you gain some you lose some so I'm okay with the size and a little bit thickness because I'm gonna get rid of my Morphe battery pack because now it makes my iPhone really light and slim again uh, let's connect the lightning cable and see if there's any charge nope so there's no charge so i'm gonna it takes around two hours to charge the whole battery in this wallet so i'm gonna pause the video and come back once the battery is charged i've done a charge on this one and it does come with an instruction saying that there's an LED indicator here if i press this one on this button it will flash two three three times Three time means it's 75% charged and four flashes means 100% charge, two flashes means 50% charge. So this is a good indicator if you're out and about to check how much is your battery power. It says on a full charge it will charge the iPhone once. It has a 2400 mAh lithium battery. So the final words, I mean, it's a good leather wallet, but it only has an iPhone cable. A Nomad also sells the Android leather wallets, but if you switch your phones in between you owning this wallet, it's no use to you unless you use an adapter. So ideally, two cables, you know, one for Android and one for a lighting cable would have been ideal, but still it's a good solid wallet and i'm quite happy to use this one because i'm getting rid of the bulky um, 
battery pack which I use for my iPhone so I'm gonna post all the details about the battery pack and the website you can buy this from in the description of this video um, please do like and subscribe my channel and we're gonna do more video reviews soon thanks for watching